Now, the story of some local high school students who are demanding change. Hundreds of Shaker Heights middle and high school students today displayed posters and wore the color orange in honor of Texas. Their message, safer schools now. Neil Fisher has that story. Tonight, students in Shaker Heights are taking action. from middle schoolers to high schoolers, demanding change throughout schools after the deadly shooting in Uvalde, Texas. Student leaders gathered hundreds of classmates on Thursday at Shaker Heights High School to honor the lives lost at Robb Elementary School. We're out here because our politicians need to make laws so that we're safe. These children shouldn't be on here. These teachers should not be killed. It's too many uh, mass shootings. We need to feel safe. Following the massacre in Texas, Students across the nation had to return to school the next day with thoughts of the possibility of it happening close to home. You almost come in and you think for an hour, you think for your first period, oh gosh, you check the windows and you check the door and you look at the people around you and you say, what if? And then you go about your day. And we can't go about our day anymore. Students at Shaker Heights telling 3 News about active shooter drills and the reality they've become. It's scary that we even have to go in there, hide under desks. It's scary because they know it's our reality. It should never be our reality. School board members, teachers, and parents standing by to support the students in Shaker Heights and ask for change across the country. It's my hope that if school boards all over the country raise their voices and pass resolutions that we can pass that on to our legislators. These aren't the parents or politicians out here demanding change, marching here at the school. These are the students themselves. And tonight, Russ, they have gained the support across the nation from Washington State to Washington, D.C. Neil Fisher in Shaker Heights. Thank you.